What up, guys? It's Rage and Rob. And welcome back to, um, I guess, my chat about The Walking Dead. So, today's Halloween. First of all, happy Halloween. I got lots of videos coming out for you guys. I got a bunch of different suits and stuff and costumes you're going to want to check out. It's great. Um, last night's episode, man, uh, how do I even talk? That was Snooze Fest? No offense to the creators. I, I love the show. Um, man... King Ezekiel, like, don't get me wrong, he's, he's okay for now, but, like, obviously the group is being forced to get shit for Negan, duh. And then when they meet Ezekiel at, uh, the kingdom, which is really weird, he also deals with the same problem, which is fine, there's, in the, in the, in the comic, there's three groups I believe I don't remember because it's been a long time since I read it but there's three groups I'm going to say that join forces and then Rick ends up being Rick and taking over like he would and they fight Negan spoiler alert for anyone who reads or watches this shit I'm going to put spoiler on the title again like the last episode which you guys liked but that's in the book what they do with the show don't get me wrong I don't know I don't have a fucking clue and I wish I did but I can't but this last episode man was just I'm gonna say unnecessary. Like they could have spoke about it, been like, "Yo, what up? This is Ezekiel. Check it out. This is the kingdom. Bang!" And then right into it. It's like, instead, it's a lot of fluff. And it's like, you know, I know they have to build the story, but like, as frustrating as a fan who fucking waits all week, turns it on, nothing happens, and it's like, oh, okay, I wasted a full fucking, you know, like, I'm not say wasted because I love the show, and, and I don't want to make it sound like I'm bashing it, but right now it's like, ah. And they do it every season, so I should be over it, but like, oh my god. But, um, yeah, like Ezekiel, so I mean, he's he's best kind for now. Best kind being a newfie term, sorry. And he... I, I don't even know what to say about it, you know, because they don't do much. They do what they're told, get us our shit, so they get the shit. And that guy that fucking taunted that guy and started fucking punching him in the face, oh my god, dude. Oh my god, I would have went fucking nuts. But that's just me. Um, it's going to be another short video because there wasn't really much to talk about. You know, the kingdom, cool. There's too much to elaborate, or not enough to elaborate on it yet to even talk. But, um, i see where next week takes us, I guess. You know, don't get me wrong. When you go from, like, a, a, a season opener to the point where I felt every fucking emotion Rick had, oh my god, to last night it's like i know you need the backstory i really do but it's like an hour an hour carol's gonna fucking leave anyways bro she's done it before you know she's done it before but you know i i know it has to add to the show so we'll see what next sunday brings us hopefully i can get this video guys out to you really soon because you know last time i did this you guys seemed to really enjoy it so I love you guys. Thank you for tuning in. Rage and Rob doing his own, or my own, fucking his own dumbass, opinions on what's going on in The Walking Dead. And I will say spoiler alert because I might bring up the comic and I might say some shit without even thinking about it, about what happens. And I don't want to ruin it for people who have already, you know, who hasn't seen it, sorry. Or hasn't read it because reading it is just 10 times better and I love the show but the comic itself is fucking amazing and oh my god just I, I advise any of you guys to do it so thank you guys for tuning in I'll see you guys in the next video Rage and Rob peace out